It is a normal day in Kumasi and residents are going about their duties. About 60% of residents are in their marks at the Prempe the Second Streets. The statue of Nana Ajman Prempe, a late king of the Asante Kingdom, overlooks the central business district. The statue has a max on it and some residents have welcomed the initiative, especially when the wearing of the max has become compulsory. This is not the first time I've seen the statue with max, but when the first time I saw it, I know it's a signal to us to wear the face mask to avoid getting the COVID or whatever. To see everyone with the mask. Nowadays, it wasn't like at the first that the COVID came. They, was, they were not taking it serious, but now they have taken it serious. So you see everyone with the mask everywhere. This is the first time I've seen something. I think I don't come here often. So I just came and saw it. And it's very, very interesting. And I think it tells something about the fact that we, as human as we are, we have to be very conscious about the pandemic and as much as possible abide by every one of the protocols. Just as you can see, I mean, even a statue put it on, it tells you something that you must to be very, very cautious about the pandemic and how, I mean, rapidly it is sweeping through everywhere. So I implore each and everyone to, to put it on. The Mencia ran about the statue of a late queen mother, Nana Efia Kobi II, also has a max. Uh, yeah, that's my first time of seeing statue wearing a nose max. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm so excited. Like, it's creating awareness to the citizens, or the people around who are just passing. So once a statue has wearing a stomach, what do we call nose marks, it's telling you, you, a human being, or the citizen, you have to wear the nose mask too. It's a kind of, to me, my impression for the first time of seeing it, it's a kind of education to the general populace. Uh, so that's my impression. Huh? To, to wear the nose marks in order to save their lives and also to save other people's lives. Although the person behind this initiative is not known, the Kumasi Metropolitan Assembly is not also aware. The assembly is, however, considering replicating the initiative in other parts of the metropolis as part of its COVID-19 prevention awareness campaign. We've also seen... Um, the statue with a mask on and we have not taken it down because it's communicating positively. It is not the assembly that placed the mask there for the records. It's not the assembly that placed the mask there. But then we've seen it and we've realized that it's communicating positively. It is giving positive signal to the general public. And so the chief executive will want to consult with the traditional authorities before we replicate it to all the other statues around because we've received a lot of calls today commending us and I have to be explaining to people that is, is not from us, but they are endorsing it. But you know, Kumasi is a typical tradition and so we want to seek clearance from Menshia before we replicate it elsewhere. With coronavirus cases rising daily, wearing a mask has become necessary. For most people who use streets where these statues are situated, there is no excuse for them not to wear their masks. Reporting from Kumase in the Ashanti region, Hafiz Tijani for City News.